In this video, I will show y'all guys how to win games using the top five best tier three teams to compete with your opponent. Now, this is in order, so I'm gonna show y'all guys who the number one is. You will be surprised. Number five, you gotta go with the Kings because you got some bonus. You got Harrison Barnes, D Fox, and you got Dante coming off the bench, but I be starting him, so it don't matter. And these guys got defense. So, for example, D Fox, he, his own ball defense is 81. His lateral quickness is 85, so he can keep up with fast guard. And not only that, speed with ball, he has a 97 in the attribute. So that means that he can move fast as crazy. But his three ball is a 72. That You could green it, but not like that. You gotta, you gotta get hot and get going to able to green his shot. So if you shoot contested shot with him, you probably gonna miss a lot of time. So make sure he's re really open so that you can green it. But other than that, he's too good in this game and he can move. And I forced my point quick. Number four is the Hornets because you got LaMelo Ball, you got Golden Hayward, Scary Terry, Rozier, and you got a couple of guys coming off the bench. You got Bridges and things like that. But now, LaMelo Ball, this guy right here is an 87 overall. He got a nice jump shot. He shoot like very high. So it's, it's kind of easy timing, but not really easy. You just gotta know how to shoot with him. But he got quick first step on Silver, so you could dribble with him. He, like this dude is a demon guard at the point guard position. You gotta switch up the matchup. Like you can't put a small guard on him because it's gonna be a GG. So make sure you have defense or somebody that's taller so they can keep up with him. But other than that, this team is very good to use and, and you need to win games, use this team. I think they're the most slept on team to use. You can five out with this team. You can do, you can do what you want. And Lamar Bowl is too good in this game. No, number three, you gotta go with the Hawks because they're a fun team to use if you're struggling or you have a hard time advancing the next league, make sure you use them because you got Trey Young. He, he's a 90 overall, should be a 92 because the way he balling in real life. And his three balls are 90, his, three, his mid range is 99, so you able to green his shot. The only problem is his jump shot is kind of funny, but other than that, he got good dribble moves, dribble style, and you could go crazy with him. And, and not just him, it's just the team. I like how it's, it's structured. You got John Collins, the dude is a dunk, could dunk the basketball like crazy. He's like a baby version of Blake Griffin, but he can shoot the three as well. And you got Compella, the guy that set a screen and catch alley hoops. And you got Hunter, the guy that guards your best player. And most of the, most of the players on that team can shoot a three ball. So they open, you can able to green it or hit your rights. So now, if you like I said, if you struggling, Try to get out the lead. Make sure you use this team so you get a ring. Oh, yeah, number two, you got to go with the Pelicans. Everybody use this team because they basically got the big three, but they're not really superstars. So you got CJ McConnell. He's an 87 overall. You got Brandon Ingram. He's an 86 overall. And Zion Worthy just came back from an update in 2K. He's an 89 overall. He's still a monster. He, he's still dunking on people. He got Hall of Fame badges like Limitless Takeoff, Pulse Wiser. This dude is a freak of nature. And you got CJ McCullough, a guy that played point guard, and he can shoot, he can dribble, he can move the ball, and he got the, one of the best dribble styles in this game. And you got Brandon Ingram, the, the boule version of Karen Durant, and he go crazy. Like, Brandon Ingram, he more slept on guy in this game, so a lot of people don't use him, but once you know how to use him, that dude is money. He can shoot, he can drive to the rim, he can do what he wants to do. And he's like 6'8". But at first they made him 6'7", and now he's 6'8 now. So 2K be confusing with the height. But I think I believe that he really 6'8". But he mad skinny, though. So this team's fun to use. So this guarantee you a win every time. And I make this guy quit. So make sure you use them. The number one on that list is a 71 bucks. I bet you a lot of people surprised by this one because this is historic team, not current. But it don't matter because everybody uses this team to win games. They're the number one on that tier three list because nobody's not stopping Korean on dude's ball. This dude's OP. He's the number one in scoring all time. Nobody stopping that man. The only person who could really slow him down a little bit is Wilt Chamberlain in tier three. But other than that, people don't use that team either. But you'll be surprised that people do use the 72 Lakers or the 71 Lakers. I don't know. It's one of those years. It's the same thing. But this team right here, the 71 Bucks, is a total package. You got Oscar Robinson, the big O. He's 6'5". He, he got quick first step on goal. He can move fast. He got a nice dribble animation. And you got Kareem on the ball with the hook shot, with the phase. He got post takeover. He grabbed rebounds and he feel like it. He get like a lot of offensive rebounds. You could, you could score at least 60 points with this man.